Good morning. This is Miss Blaine, and I wanted to show you something really cool on my computer. So, as you can see, I'm on Google, and I go into this search bar and I type Music Lab, and Chrome Music Lab comes up. So, I'm going to click on that and check this out. There's all kinds of fun things that you can play around with. So, there's Song Maker. Rhythm, spectrogram, uh, something I can't see because my face is covering it. Let's see what it, I moved myself. Uh, chords, sound waves, arpeggios, Kandinsky, melody maker, voice spinner, harmonics, piano roll, oscillators, and strings. All kinds of cool stuff, but let's start with the first one. This one with the little happy face. Song Maker, let's click on it and see what happens. Well, that's pretty. So, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go into settings, see the little gear, click that. And once again, I got to move myself so I can see. Notice here it says scale. So, instead of major, Let's change it to pentatonic. So pentatonic means five notes, like a pentagon has five sides, a pentatonic scale has five notes. And so um, everything that you do with a pentatonic scale is gonna sound nice. Okay, and let's experiment. We, we just click around and it makes different sounds and colors. That's kinda neat. You can even drag it to make different patterns. And what's this? It says marimba. What if I change it to piano? Yeah, that's neat. How about if I change it to strings? Cool. I'm going to hit the play button. Okay, uh, it repeats. So I'm going to stop that. And I noticed that when I changed the, the little uh, button right here, that all the different squares played with, uh, with that kind of um, quality with that instrument sound. So if I choose woodwind, let's try that out. This sounds like a clarinet. That's cool. All right. What's this? Synth. Let's try that one. Cool. So I'm going to go back to marimba. And here it's got blocks, kit, conga, electronic. Hmm. I'm gonna try kit and see what happens. So if I click here, yeah, it's like a drum, check that out. So you can make different patterns with that. Let's hit play again. What if I decide to start over? Well, go over here and undo. Okay, so that undoes one thing at a time. Hmm. How about if I want to just scrap the whole thing and restart? That would be up here. Check that out, it's clean now. So now that I have a better understanding, I know that this is this is the part that controls the the um, percussion down here and then this is the part that controls the colored blocks up here so marimba let's say i start painting some some blocks here randomly and let's say i want to play with uh this bar Tempo. Tempo means how fast it's going. And this little number, it says 120. 
120 is 120 beats per minute, which would be two per second. So that's a little bit on the fast side. So what if I slide it this way and make it a smaller number like 80? Let's try it. Okay, let's say I wanna go as fast as I can. So the fastest it goes is 240. So if you want to, you can save that if you like that. And check it out, there's a link here. So you can copy the link. So you go click like that and copy it. So if you wanna play around with it, I would love to hear your creations. Go ahead and email them to me. I would love to hear them. So my email is sblaine at sandy.net. Have fun playing around with SongMaker. <laughs>